think I was 16 years old, my mum and dad said to me, you know, we don't want you in the bikes. If you come home with a bike, you can, you can pack your bags and leave. So I bought a bike, I come home, packed all my shit up and left. I'm Sean and I'm a head fabricator here at Atomic Motors. <laughs> a month before I turned 40 I said oh let's just pack our stuff up and go on a cruise and we'll go over to America and see what happens so we jumped on a cruise ship with two suitcases and we're still here 14 years later. I'm more known in the motorcycle scene you know building custom bikes racing bikes things like that but um, you know coming here the, the reason why we sort of come here to start with is because if you want to be the best at something you've got to be with the best and you've got to be competing against the best so that's why we sort of come here to do that. I had a, a bike that I won number one uh, custom bike in America with basically traveled around the, the country with that bike and won, won everything with that bike and ended up getting the number one bike builder in, in America and they uh, they gave me a trophy and it's like to win that was to represent America at the world championships in Germany and being Australia a lot of people didn't like that, that I'd won. <laughs> Doing a full full ground up bike for like a, a show, I just start with a piece of steel and then just work from there. Um, like the last bike I built, I, I found this really cool old SU carburetor. So I started with the carburetor and just built the rest of the bike around it. I'll have it in my head, I, I can't really draw, but I sort of have everything pictured in my head. I'll start off with, like I said, one piece on the bike, and then I'll start making a chat, making a frame and everything. But when I pick up that first piece of steel, because I sort of understand geometry of bikes, I sort of know how that bike's going to ride when I pick up that first piece of steel on it. So the feeling in that, when you actually get on it and ride it, is, is amazing, you know? 